curved surface area, total surface area of frustum. What is a frustum of a cone? We all know that a cone is a three-dimensional shape which looks like this. Let us suppose we cut a plane parallel to the base of this cone and separate the two parts. Then the smaller part is known as the conical part because it looks like a cone. Whereas the bigger part on the other side of the plane is called the frustum of the cone. A frustum of a cone has two flat surfaces, one bigger than the other and a curved surface. We can define a frustum of a cone using four dimensions that is height, slant height, radius 1 and radius 2. There are always two different radii in a frustum of a cone and the radius of the bigger flat surface is always larger than the radius of the smaller flat surface. This three-dimensional solid is known as the frustum of a cone. Now let us understand some formula related to frustum of a cone. In a frustum of a cone, there is a special relationship between height, slant height and the two radii. In this relationship, the slant height of a frustum is given as L equals to root h square plus r1 minus r2 square. Using this relationship, we can find the value of any dimension of a frustum provided the other three are known to us. What is the curved surface area of a frustum of a cone? If you remember, the curved surface area of a cone is pi r l. Since in a frustum we have two radii, so in place of r, we will write r1 plus r2. Therefore, the curved surface area of a frustum is given as pi l multiplied by r1 plus r2. Using this formula, we can calculate the curved surface area of a frustum of a cone. What is the total surface area of a frustum of a cone? It is the combined area of the flat and curved surface of a frustum. A frustum has three surfaces, top flat surface, bottom flat surface and curved surface. The area of the top flat surface is equal to the area of a circle of radius r1, that is pi r1 square. Similarly, the area of the bottom flat surface is equal to the area of the circle radius r2, that is pi r2 square. And we already have discussed that the area of the curved surface of a frustum is pi l multiplied by r1 plus r2. Combining all these areas, we get the total surface area of a frustum as pi r1 square plus pi r2 square pi l multiplied by r1 plus r2. Using this formula, we can calculate the total surface area of a frustum of a cone.